my room has been in a desperate need of a facelift. That is why in today's video, I'm gonna be doing the ultimate room makeover and turning it into the Pinterest room of my dreams. How am I supposed to? <laughs> Look how cute. Are you kidding me? That is my room. <laughs> So the first thing that I want to do before I get started with decorating or anything in general, even just rearranging my room, I'm going to clear out my room in the sense of like, I'm going to be removing my rug, I'm going to be picking up everything off the floor and just kind of getting ready to... Who's texting me? Oh, it's my boyfriend. I am going to be rearranging my room. Surprise! Thank you. Okay. Oh my goodness. Wait, why am I even doing this? I don't know why I'm moving my desk because I literally have a brand new desk. So I feel like it's kind of pointless. Right now, I am going to be deconstructing this desk because it's so tiny. Don't know what that was. Yes, those are eyelashes on my desk. I can do all things. Do Christ the strength keeps me out. I almost got a hernia. Ow. I come. Ow. We did it. Woo. How am I supposed to put the legs? Like, how how is one person supposed to do that? I'm all for being an independent woman and I love doing everything by myself and I don't really like asking for help. But I'm gonna have to ask for help. Hi. Hey. I need somebody to help. Oh, thanks. Oh. It's looking absolutely marvelous. I can't wait to decorate it. I'm gonna build my nightstand now because I wanna have a different one. The one that I had before was just not feeling the vibes. So I got a new one and I'm excited. Are you ready for this humongous haul of everything that I got to decorate my room? I don't think you guys are ready. Okay, I'm so excited. Are you freaking kidding me? This was for the Valentine's Day collection. I also ended up getting these heart-shaped bowls. This was for the Valentine's Day collection from TJ Maxx. I honestly want to use this small one for like my jewelry, some of my jewelry pieces. Huge white bubble candle from Home Goods. I also saw this little candle holder from TJ Maxx. Then I got this little plant. I also got this candle. This is the second bag we have this humongous pillow this is from the ugg brand and these pillows feel absolutely insanely fluffy i got a little candy or candle and it says you go glen coco like are you kidding me and it smells like cocoa peppermint cocoa so this i got from amazon white cloud tray doesn't smell like anything, but it's supposed to be like a candle. It's just like literal roses all over. I got this little flower arrangement. I don't even know what kind of flowers these are. If you guys know what kind of plant this is, please let me know. And this is the last bag. This was like my best find ever. Ah, look how cute. 
cute. I got this blanket also from Home Goods. This is another pillow that I ended up getting. This was Valentine's Day themed. I just feel like it's not gonna go with my bed because it has red. I did end up getting this little book of Dior from Amazon. I also got some wall decor that I have to go print out at Walmart because I haven't printed it out yet and I might get some new frames. I think <gasps> I'm forgetting about like one of the best parts. Hold up. Ah! Look at this freaking mirror. When I saw this, I was like so I had to like snatch her up real quick before somebody else took her and now she's mine and I'm so happy and excited So now I am going to be taking down all of my old wall art Bye bye puffer snoopy It's no longer puffer snoopy season Okay, so we're also gonna be redecorating Milo's area because right now it's not it's not really giving are you ready for your new rug? This one's trash. I also got you this new little teepee house. It looks like this. I'm a perfectionist so it is really hard for me to not obsessively hyper analyze every little detail I rearranged my makeup like I think three times and my cart twice because I was not happy with how it looked and I don't know like I don't know we're gonna do it this process in itself took over an hour which is ridiculous but that is just how obsessive I am like who's to say that the first time you decorate something is the best that it's ever gonna look like what if the second time you decorate it is better or the third how i genuinely wish you guys could look at the state of my room right now so this little corner right here i plan to put my pink mirror right here and then just obviously redecorate this because this is not giving at all lamp because i feel like sometimes the lights in my room they're just not the vibe i feel like it could be better lit in my room i don't like my main light i just feel like it's very harsh and i just want like that cozy warm ambient lighting
I'm gonna hang up my wall art. I honestly was having such a hard time finding a set of three pictures because I want three pictures for my wall. And I was having such a hard time finding three pictures that really went with my room, like looked cute, was aesthetic, matched the colors. I don't know if I did a good choice. Like I still don't know because I have to hang it up to see it. I got mine from Walmart if you guys are wondering. So this is how big I got them. I got them 16 by 20. <gasps> no. You're lying. They gave me three of this. Who am I showing? No, this this can't be. This. Are you kidding me? They gave me three of the same pictures. That that's. Oh my goodness, you guys. Okay, so I went through so many struggles to finally get my room done and it's done. It's finished. I am honestly in love with how my room turned out and I can't wait to show you guys and I hope that it can be of some inspo for any of your guys' rooms. I just, I love how everything turned out. I love the color scheme and anyway, I'm rambling. I'm yapping. Let me show you guys. <laughs> Okay, I've been working so hard on this. Let me give you a room tour. Okay, so the first thing that you see when you come into my room is obviously my door. I didn't change anything. I still have my 2024 vision board up, but right next to my door, I have my mirror. I placed my mirror here because I thought it would look so cute. And then right next to my mirror is my lamp and my storage cart. I love how it turned out. I added little bow details on the side because I was gonna have it flipped the other way but I think it looks better like that and then look at my desk okay you guys this took so long to finally just settle down and say you know what I think this is it I think this is how I'm gonna decorate my desk I have my little hydrangeas there I have my little dumpling some of my jewelry pieces that I really love in this little cloud tray, I decided to put all of my fragrances and the little rose candle and this little house that I'm obsessed with. And of course, my little sunny angel standing outside of the house because he's so cute. And this little mini Glossier solid perfume because I felt like it just went perfectly, especially since my perfumes are right here. And then on this side, I have my candier candle and my Glossier lip balm. And then here, actually, I have to change the date. I forgot to change the date and this is the quote of the day for you guys if you're not willing to risk the unusual you will have to settle for the ordinary i love this little calendar because it really does motivate me in the mornings whenever i have to do some work then next to my calendar i have my joe malone scarlet poppy perfume and then underneath my calendar i just have my little book of dior my planner and then the book of healing which is one of my favorite books ever and then over here i have my nightstand that also took forever to perfect i have my candle from tj maxx my lululemon water bottle my vitamins then i have my sunny angel with the birthday cake and my white bubble candle and then i also put my salt lamp here because i thought it looked super cute just added that little pop of like orange just break up all the pink so it's not like pink everywhere and then i added my little tulips and this super cute textured vase and then i added also my replica candle this one is on a date not my favorite scent but it's still super cute and then this is definitely one of my favorite parts of my little nightstand this little heart tray. I put my Dior lip balm, my Dior serum, and the Glossier little phone charm. It's so freaking cute. You can't even tell me it's not. And then right here, I put another one of my Glossier lip balms. This one is the birthday cake one. And in here, if you guys are curious, I just have a bunch of random things, just a bunch of random stuff. And then down here is kind of like my skincare drawer because I have a lot of skincare, some masks and stuff that I don't use every single day. And that's what's in there. And now let me show you guys my wall art. Okay, don't judge me for how I hung these because I used the leveler, but it was so, so hard to hang these up. Like you guys have no idea the struggle that I went through to hang these, like it was ridiculous. But anyway, I got this picture that says 70 times seven because hello, one of my favorite Bible verses. And then this one says, we love because he first loved us. And I really just wanted to have wall art that reminds me 
me and that really just fills me up in the morning and fills me up whenever I see it. And then this one is just two little bows because I'm obsessed with bows and I'm obsessed with pink. So <laughs> that's pretty much it. And this is my bed. I am obsessed with it. I just want to show you guys. This is what it looks like. It's so cute. I got these little jelly cat marshmallows that I'm obsessed with. And then this teddy bear my boyfriend got me for Valentine's Day. And then this chunky knit blanket. If you guys have been watching my videos, you know that I've been knit crocheting this for so long and I'm obsessed with how it turned out. I love it and the fact that I made it myself makes me feel so much better. I just wanted to show you guys what my sheets look like because you can't really see them but they are from Amazon. I just love the little floral pattern on it. I changed my curtains. I just changed them to white because I felt like it looked so much better with my room and then obviously my fairy lights just make it look so much cuter. I also added these little steps because I'm trying to get Milo to go on my bed but he just does not want to and sorry don't mind the poops he poops a lot but this is his area and yeah he bunstructed his area he did not want his little teepee in the corner he just wanted to put it wherever he wanted and this is him he knows i'm talking about him hi how are you you're so cute I love you. And then right next to Milo's area, I do have his food. This is where all his hay goes. And I wanted to get something that looked cute to put all of his hay. And then over here, I have my air purifier that I currently have off because I need to find an outlet for it. And then I never took down this heart mirror because I don't know, I just feel like whatever, it's there. I'm not even gonna bother. This is my clothing rack and I moved it from this wall to this wall and I feel like it looks so much better here. And then this has to be my favorite part of my room. Oh my goodness, you guys, this is definitely my favorite part. This mirror is just the cutest mirror that I've ever seen. I love this mirror so freaking much. Can't wait to take pictures in it. This is what I chose the layout to be. This is my little galaxy starlight lamp. Another lamp and then my Jizu perfume. I have like little mini travel size perfumes here. I have my Jo Malone box and then down here I love this color scheme. I have Glossier and then I have the Candier candle and then I have my little speaker. But yeah, that is my room and I hope you guys love it as much as I do because I genuinely really love it. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing how my room turned out and give this video a big thumbs up if you did and comment down below what you loved the most about my room. I honestly can't pick because I love every single thing. I love how everything turned out. So let me know what you think in the comments and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We are so close to 100k. I believe in us. Stay tuned for my next video. I love you guys so freaking much. God bless you. God loves you. Show love. Bye. Mm-hmm.